welcome back to Modern Minecraft with me. Today's episode, we're gonna get into something very cool. I think it's cool. Um, we're gonna get into drawers. Because, um, if you, I don't know how many of you have watched a lot of my episodes of modded Minecraft before, but I was watching back my first ever modded series here on YouTube, which is Survival Stories 3, The Avenger Pack by Esco85, and there are some techniques that I'd like to use in this series. And, um, one of them is, um, in that series, I was using a thing called Jabba. It's not in this mod pack right now, but there's a thing close to it in this mod pack, and it's Quadrors. So, I, it's a really cool mod pack, um, and I figured we could get into Drawers. So, um, at Drawers, so the Drawer mod has a lot of different things, um, and I think it's going to be enough time, so let's sleep first before we get into Drawers. And, um, I'm also going to... Uh, I'm going to enable some music, too. Um, so, hopefully it's not too loud. So, we're going to ask the autocraft this, too. So, we're going to use this as the basic drawer. And a chest. It can be a regular trap chest or a trap chest. There's several ways of making chests. So, we're just going to look at that first. Okay. So we got our chest, and we got our basic drawer. Um, and then with that, you'll need a key for the drawer if you want to unlock it. And that's this guy. So that will give us that, and we got ingots. Another thing is a compacting drawer. Now that's the interesting thing as well. Um, okay, that's that one. Now, do we have s stone? We have a lot of stone, so I'm not worried about that. Okay. And, okay, so we got the compacting drawer, right? And there's a controller as well that we should make. This is more like, um, other things if you want to get into it. Oh good, that's auto crafted, okay. I was not sure if it was. Okay, so that gives us that. Packing drawer two. Then there are things called upgrades that I also like to make. Basic one, iron one, each one of these we should be able to make. That's it. All right. 
Oh. So now. Let's make some drawers. So we're gonna go to drawer. So we wanna make let's make a basic drawer. Let's look at basic drawers first. And now we can easily make more. So a basic drawer is basically a drawer. You can put things in it. See how it says there's 64 items in it? If you right click, you can ask the open or er, shift. You can take the items out. All right. If you shift and right click on it, it'll bring up this menu. This is the menu where you can put the upgrades in it. And you can also see how many are in there. And I believe if you, you can actually take the items and move them around a click or two. Another thing about drawers as well, is if you just need one, you can just get one. If you want a stack, you can get a stack. So, one, just by clicking once, you can put them all in. If you just need one, so like for recipes, you might need just one of something. And then you just go, boom, or shift click and you get them all out. You know what the I like these these things but they're causing trouble right now <laughs> so so say I wanted to let's grab a lot of iron because we have a lot so let's I'm gonna go out here let's put this down right now, you can see it says, how many it says, and again, if you click, click in here, you can see how many are in there. But this only can hold so many, right? Well, that's where the upgrades come into a place. So let's fill this up. Alright. So you can see I can't, hold, I can't put any more in there. So, you know what, I'm going to pause this, <laughs> um, the music, sorry about that, um, so like I was saying, um, th the basic drawer will hold this many, this many items, that's a lot of items, now, with the upgrade in it, okay, so we're going to go ahead, get more iron, and a drawer, um, upgrade. And what are they called? Storage upgrades, right? Yeah. Storage. Why is it not popping up? Well, I guess we could just make it then. All right. Well, that's <laughs> uh, right. Oh. Storage. Upgrade, so got uh, where's number one? Okay, so let's go ahead and make one of these. And it's very quick at making them. So now it'll hold more. So I'm gonna go ahead and how to put this in is you can either um, just right click on it or you can open it up and put it in. So let's go ahead and get more iron, or more s uh, stone, or I mean more iron, because we got so much of it. It's probably from our chickens, my guess. So you can see, this has got 20,000, this has almost got double.
I, I figured I'd do, I, I mean, I could have done any material, really. But iron is, we have a lot of, and I figured iron would be the best one to do it. Okay, so now, if you open this guy up, you can see it's got 40,000. So, it pretty much doubled um, the materials in the drawer. Oh, that just came from over there. Okay. So, pretty much, it doubled how much can be in the drawer. And that's a lot of iron. And, obviously, as you go up in drawer sizes, so, if I go to, you know, obviously, the higher one, which, which is the highest one that we have? It's the emerald one. So, let's make one of these. And then we'll get another drawer. No, not not that one of these. Yep. Nope. So we got one of those. And so a compacting drawer. I don't know what this this is. Let's see. That's compacting. A two, oh, wait a minute. This might be like a level two. And what's the other one? Um, a controller. So let's make a controller too. So I don't need this. I don't need this. I don't need the chunk loader anymore. I'll keep the disc on me. Um, so we're going to sleep. So today's episode, we're just going to look at drawers. Um, eventually, I think I'd like to switch over to using drawers, because, um, you know, they're pretty cool. And, um, so now with this one, if I go in there, you can hold, and you can get as many of these as you can. So, like I said, right now, this one just has one. This one has just one, n nothing in here. So, the basic drawer can hold 2,048 items. The drawer two, four thousand, and I keep on getting weak because I'm right next to the thing. This guy will hold so much more, and because of that, um, I'm just gonna go in into here and just grab iron. I mean, because we have MC and we can easily burn it back into MC if we need to. But I just wanted to show you, like, this is very, like, OP, really, because of how much it can store. Um, there are, I think in this mod pad that I, you know, I designed, there's also deep storage. Um, yeah, so, I think deep storage, I'm not sure how much that can store, but I believe it's a lot. Um, but we might get into that as well, as well, too. So, as you see here, as I'm filling up my inventory of this, okay, it, I'm just going to keep on filling my inventory <coughs> with this lovely iron that I have here. And I keep on, because I'm right next to this thing, it's giving me the items from that. I mean, look how many it's actually physically taking. And it's still not even filled. So, look how much that is. That's 13k. And that's just the bait. That's the, you know, 32 based on 32 increases it by 32. So, yeah. So, that's what that does. A controller, what the controller does is it controls these. So, say you have a ME system, like Refine or Reborn or Applied. You can add this to your network, and everything in these drawers... I'm just going to... And you can actually see, I'm just... Yeah. Okay. 
Okay. So yeah, this one's still yeah. So that's okay. Whoop. Alright. So you can <laughs> Alright, I wanna get in here and take this one out. So like I said, the basic one is this one here. And I just threw an arrow. So that's the basic one without any upgrades. This one has that upgrade. Look how many it can hold. With the controller, you can actually control them with that. Or you can get a compacting drawer, which a compacting drawer, depending on the type it is. Um compacting two drawers. This is okay, so there's one that just has one. And then there's this one that ha I don't like. I like the other one better. Um, just a regular compacting drawer. This will let you compact two different items. Which, yeah. So the nice thing about the compacting drawers, if I get some iron here. And again, you can still use upgrades in this as well. Um, by, well, maybe you can't. That is interesting. Oh yeah, you can. So what a compacting drawer does is if you put a piece in, you can see that it's got now ingots and it's got the block. So you can pretty much just put in what you want, all right? And it'll tell you how much each. So that was a stack, right? That was a stack of, um. okay. So how many is that? Um. So if I just take a stack, okay, so if I just put a stack in here, now you can see, okay, a stack is 560, or 576 nuggets, or 7 blocks of iron. So that's how many iron you can get from this. So again, this will hold more, and granted, yes, you can upgrade this as well by, you know, putting one of these in. The nice thing about this, if you can control it to a controller, it will show up as well. The nice thing about these things is, say you have a lot of items. So, you know, this is totally, uh, so, remember, this has that many, right? So let's take these out. I'm just going to put it in there. So right now, um, let's see here. I'm just going to make this a little bit nicer here. I'm getting more seeds and stuff, which I don't need. All right. Can you stop giving me the seeds, please? Um, so you saw how many that was, right? So now if I go over here, compacted them all and I think that you can hold more in compacting drawers than in regular drawers and it looks like there's some more in, in there still okay so you can see that I have 18k of that 248 of that and 200 bits of iron now if I go back to this we might I'm, I'm not sure I have yeah you can hold more so basically, this is a better way of storing iron. Because you can see how much I can store. It's either in block form. So the nice thing about this is you can, it doesn't, it stores it in the block form unless you need it. So basically, if I wanted a lot of iron in there, okay, all I do is select it, and it goes right in there. So you can you can see what it says I have, how much of if say I want a block, I can go and get the block. If I just need an ingot, I can just hit the ingot. If I want the ingot ingot, you can hit the ingot. So it's just a lot better um, for storage. So what I'm thinking is, in the next few episodes, or I don't know, in the next main elect not live stream, we redesign to having, and there's another system I want to get into 
in the next episode, I think I want to get into it. Um, it is a um better way of moving. Well, not very really better way of moving items, but it's the way I was doing it in, like I said, in that Survival Stories three episode. Um, there's nothing in there, right? Oh, good. Um. Um, yeah, I got so much in there. Let's see what the what. Let's see how much that we can put in this compacting drawer here. There's got to be a limit. Okay. Let's see how much we can put in there. Okay. So we can, yeah, so it's basically double the amount of iron. Because what it's doing is just compacting it. But once again, you can just not not a drive. You can always just put one of these guys in, and then you can have more disk or more space for stuff. <laughs> Trying to open it. Okay, well. May I have to have an open hand to open it, maybe? Okay, let's try this more. So yeah, the drawer system is really cool. In a sense that you can really have so many items in there. And, what, and now I can't take this uh, this thing out, but yeah, you see, yeah. See how much that. Let's see. Let's try, let's try to take everything out of this drawer here. I'm gonna, there's a lot in there, isn't there? Okay. Oh wow, so that can hold more than this. Okay, you know what, we're gonna just... Let me see all that. <laughs> it's not like we need all of it anyway. Get it back in MC form. So the highest you can go in one of these is that many. Interesting. So is that more? Well, that's obviously more. 1870k. Yeah, so the nice thing is if you need a block of iron, you can get a block of iron. If you just need nuggets, you can get a piece of nugget. If you just need iron for some odd reason, you hit the iron. Alright, so let's grab our uh, meditation table. So basically, what a drawer can do is it can hold different things, as we've seen in today's episode. So like I said, there is basically the basic drawer, which is this. There are upgrades, which you can... Seriously. So there are... And I must have hit that. Yeah, I did. Oh, so you can't... Okay, that's fine. So there is basically... The basic drawer, which you can put upgrades in it. Then there is the compacting drawer, which you can also put in. But the compacting drawer actually compacts items. So if you have iron, it'll give you the nuggets, it'll give you the blocks of iron, depending on what, bl what item you need to get from it. So, so 
and then and then obviously the controller controls um if you have an emmy system like we do in here that will control the items that we have coming in so basic drawer compaction drawer <laughs> and then the controller are what we've gone over today um hopefully you enjoy the the, the context of this um and, and like i said we, have, we still have a lot of iron so just a week pat um this can hold so much depending on the version of um d this thing so this is the highest here so it's 32 times and this is uh the one time oh so that we put the one time in there so we got the one time and we got the bigger one in here yeah so let me go ahead and empty out the iron but yeah so pretty much oh well whatever i think i got a screenshot let's see if i just get one so yeah basic uh, drawers are pretty awesome and like i said the controller actually control what you can have in the system um and and let you get it out so controllers are pretty cool um and they're emceeable so that's good too emceeing is very good but uh yeah so drawers are pretty awesome um i i haven't really used drawers before i mean i think in the I think we used them with Big Mac when we were doing um, Stone Block for a little bit. Yes, yeah, so you gotta have nothing in your hand. So, yeah, we're gonna pick up these things right here. And I'm gonna pick up. Th I'm just gonna leave the iron in here. In this, um, I think I should still be able to pick it up and move it around. Yes, I can. So we're gonna go ahead and just. Um, you can see it's kind of like taped up. That means it's got something in it. Contains. It's sealed within. Um, so that means you can easily move things around. Um, Two. Um. I guess we'll just leave it there for right now. But this is a, a one way that you can get all the different things you need. So if you need nuggets. So when we get to building, we can easily just use that. And I'm wondering if we have a lot of iron, like a lot of iron coming in. We should. Yeah, it's going up. Yeah, it's going up. Yeah, I think it's because we have those, uh, these chickens back here, and I'm sure there's an iron chicken back here. <laughs> but yeah, so, um, that's what companion tours are, they're pretty cool. Um, and like I said, all you need is a controller, and you can connect it right into your ME system, and then you can set, um... A, uh, a way to just move everything in there and if it does get filled up you can easily there's several things you can do put another upgrade in there that's what you can do so there's you know that 32 one is pretty cool um and if I do stack let's see Level one. I don't know why it does level one first. So emerald. Did I not do emerald? Hmm. Emerald. I guess I didn't do emerald. Two, three, five. 
I didn't do emerald. Okay, well, let's do that one. I thought I did the emerald one, but I guess I didn't. I did. Why is it not showing up then? Emerald. Is it not? That's 16. 1, 2, 3. Got 4, right? There's an iron one. Did I get that one? Okay, I got that one. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> what was I was gonna say. Okay, that's why it was already made. Do we need this eye out? Okay, there we go. Um, so I think if I put this guy in, you can then take that guy out, but then you got that guy stuck there, unless you make another uh, storage disk, which is this one. And then I'll move over here. And then I'm going to just hit shift and get this here. And then we can take that out. And then now this will hold a whole lot more iron. So yeah, so uh, now if I go in here and get iron. And you can just pop it in. And you can hold as much iron as you need. So once again, yeah, that's what uh, companion drawers do. Um, it is going to be coming nighttime. Um, hopefully you like the companion drawers. Um, it's a cool mod to have. Oh, we should check the boost out a little bit here, too. Since we have been... I don't know if there's any new ones coming out. Oh, I'm not working on it yet. Oh, okay. I mean, I have this... Th these guys here. What this these guys are, but, um, I wonder if, electronic, I don't have that guy, interesting, alright, well, how do I make that guy, do I have silver, alright, so, I think I have silver, yes, I do, so, we've got silver, and gold. Silver and gold. Tin. Boom. Uh, silver and that one. And the lead one is iron. And cyan. Which I don't have cyan. Okay. So that's another one we'll have to work on, which is blue lapis. And cat's eye. Okay. We're going to have that one, or that one, to make the lead. And we'll need the iron. That will be the next one after that. Cyan to get lead, and okay, that makes that okay. So we have a few different ones going. I think I don't know what this one makes. I just or this one here. Um, I do want to sleep on that. So we might work on some chicken stuff in the next episode to get some of these going. Um, because we have some roost stuff here we can do. Um, to get more chickens, obviously, because, uh, I love chickens, and, you know, I love chickens from all the chickens I've done already. <laughs> um, so, yeah, we'll probably work on these chickens 
So we got this tin silver. Um, I don't. I think that's the one. I'm not sure what it makes. Is that the cool? Yeah, I'll have to look and see what we have and what we don't have. Um, aluminum. We got rubber. We got a lot of them, so that's good. So yeah, we'll work on these in the next one. Um, so we need the uh, okay. So we need silver. The silver and gold one makes that one. And then this guy will need, like I said, the iron, the lapis in uh, that one to make that one, and then, then combine that one with that one. That'll take care of these, right? Because that's iron. Well, that that's iron one. Yeah, blue, blue, and then okay. This one I'm not sure what it is like. Gold, no, it's not that one. Check what is it? Is it this one? Oh, it's this one. Yeah, tin and gold, tin and gold. Yeah, so that's them. Okay, so we got that one. Well, let's get these all like right as long as I don't mix them up here. <laughs> so uh, where was it? This is this one. Uh, this one is that one. Um, then we're gonna have this one here, the silver, silver and gold. Then we're gonna have th this guy, the lapis and cat eye. Okay, to make this guy. And then when that guy gets made, then he'll be combined with this guy to make that one. So we'll work on at least three, and we have enough things here. So yeah, we'll probably work on chickens in the next episode. Maybe we'll do a live stream soon. I don't know. I want to... I know I have an air charm in there, but let's just get one and fly around this lovely area here. I love the charm. Don't you guys? So now you can just get a thumbnail if I wanted a live stream. And there's a villager. But, uh, yeah. Me, I think that that's what we'll probably do. The next episode in this series, me will do a live stream and work on some more roost. Um, get more chickens going. Because they take a long time, as you probably know. Um, yeah. I think that would be a good idea. So we can stay here, work on some roost, uh, figure out what we want to do. Um, in the next live stream. Maybe the next episode we'll work on the other thing I was telling you about. Um, which kind of requires this stuff to haul. So I don't know if I really want to get into it without having it. We might actually have it, I think. Um, do we have... I don't know if we need electric steel. But we need lead. Do we have lead? Lead. Electric steel. We probably have lead from our ore miners, Ashley. Yeah, so we have lead ore, so we can get lead if we need it. Um, so yeah, we can ask the, uh, if we need some, uh, is this, ah, see, it's not one of those that you can, um, ore process. So what we need to do, just in preparation for it. We're going to put it in here. And it will make the lead and then we can just, uh... see here. Lead. So then we got a little bit of this coming in. So we'll change that into the ingots that we will probably need. 
Okay, that should be t 10 should be enough. And then we'll go over here. And put them in there. And now we should have lead. Oh, no, that's interesting. That's not MCable. That's not MCable, but the lead itself is. Okay, yeah, we're gonna. I, I, I'm gonna MC that. Are you kidding me? <laughs> lead. Because I think we're gonna need a whole bunch of that. So that we don't have to. There we go. Alright, that should take care of the lead issue. Um. Yeah. How's our drives doing, first of all? One point. <laughs> it's only using seven million. <laughs> and once we get this set up, we won't need you need to worry about it. So yeah, so maybe in the next episode we'll work on that. But until the next episode here in my modded. Let's play series. Um, yeah. So we worked on a little bit of um, drawer stuff. We did a little chicken experience. I see what we have, what we don't have. Um, so we might do a live stream in the next episode, or we might just do another uh, another episode. Hopefully, you like um, these videos I've been shooting pretty much on the day. Until the next episode, as we save and quit. Um, I'm going to have to say what I normally say in my, my videos. And, um, that will be... Bye-bye. For now.